Hi guys, I'm Pilar. I'm eight years old. I live in Gandia in the Valencian community of Spain. Are you surprised at my videos in English today? I have something special for you guys in this video. Today, I'm going to show you some words that are similar in Spanish and in Filipino. There are a lot actually, but today I'm only going to show you five. It's funny actually, because sometimes it's the same word, but sometimes it has a different meaning. My first word is basta. In Spanish, it's basta. In Filipino, it's basta. In Spanish, basta means enough and you're kind of annoyed when you say it. In Filipino, it means whatever and you don't know what to do whenever you say it. Let me give you an example in Spanish. Let's say that someone is annoying me, like this. I can say, basta! I can say, basta ya! Now let me give you an example in Filipino. Now somebody might ask you a question that you don't know. Like this. Pilar, ano oras ka matutulog? Basta, pagantok na ako. My second word is siempre. In Spanish, it's siempre, which means always. In Filipino, it's siempre, which means of course. Like for example, in Spanish, we, you can say, Yo siempre voy al supermercado a comprar manzanas. In Filipino, when someone asks you, Pilar, Filipino ka ba? You can say, Siempre! My third word is demasiado. In Spanish, it's demasiado, which means too much. In Filipino, it's demasiado, which means the opposite. It means not really. So, for example, in Spanish, you can say, En verano hace demasiado calor. And in Filipino, if someone asks you, Pilar, magaling ka ba kumanta? Di masyado. My fourth word is seguro. In Spanish, it's seguro, which means sure. In Filipino, it's seguro, which means maybe. For example, you can say in Spanish, Estoy seguro de que va a ser un buen día. For example, in Filipino, you can say, Siguro magandang araw ngayon. My last word is vale. Sometimes it can have the same meaning in Filipino and in Spanish if you want to say what something is worth. For example, in Spanish you can say, El coche vale 17,000 euros. And in Filipino, you can say, Vale isang million piso ang coche. But sometimes, vale can mean something different in Filipino and in Spanish. In Spanish, vale can also mean okay. And in Filipino, vale can also be a useless filler word where you don't know how to start a sentence. For example, in Spanish, you can say, Voy a la escuela mañana, vale? And in Filipino, you can say, vale... Hindi ko alam kung saan ako pumunta. Wasn't that fun, guys? Nice pictures and videos with Pilar. See you next time!